Hi everyone, welcome back to our Monday meditation. This is the second one of the day, so thank you so much for taking the time, spending, spending it with us. So I don't know where you guys are from, let us know. It's a rainy, chilly day here in New Jersey. So actually it's not chilly, it's 70 degrees, but um, it feels cold in my house. <laughs> So what we're going to be doing today is just kind of intention setting, figuring out what we want to accomplish this week. We're going to just take some time to get comfortable. I'm sitting on a yoga block right now. I have my hips above my knees. You want to see if it's comfortable for you sitting down, lying down, whichever way is good. So we're just going to take this time to kind of reset ourselves focus on what intention we want for ourselves this week. So we're gonna start by taking in three long, deep breaths. I'm gonna take our last one. So we're just gonna start off by, if we're feeling comfortable, closing our eyes, or we can just have our gaze down low. If we'd like, we can use our hands as an anchor to help bring ourselves into our bodies. And you don't have to think of a specific word that you wanna use in this moment as far as what your intention is. You can just think about it and see what comes to your mind. So I'm gonna invite you to stay in that comfortable position and need to either close your eyes or keep them open with a low gaze and just see if any inspiration comes into your mind. So we're gonna take these few moments of silence to just process. You may find your mind wandering in these moments, and that's okay. Just do your breath best to bring your thoughts back to your breath. Just notice these thoughts. Is it something that's coming up that's telling you that you need to focus on? Could that be your intention for the day or for the week? I'm finding for myself some thoughts that are popping into my head or just worry about how everything is going. There's still a lot of unknowns in our field of nonprofit and working in schools. There's a lot of unknowns. So my intention is going to be focusing and facing that fear and turning it into action. So my intention for this week is action, of doing things, of making sure I'm staying on top of my work and being proactive about things. Once we have our intentions in our minds, 
We're just gonna do a little grounding exercise now. So take this moment to bring your awareness to your body. We're gonna focus first on our toes. Can you feel the ground under you? Are your legs straight out? Do they feel a little tingly? Next, we're gonna move up to our feet. We're gonna see how they're feeling. Are they cold? Are they warm? Next, we're moving up to our legs. How do they feel supporting your body? Now we're gonna to move to our seat. Take a moment to notice how that feels. Does it feel sturdy under you? Does it feel shaky? Just observe without judgment. Next, we're moving up to our belly. And really take a moment to see how your belly feels. A lot of people hold tension, stress, worry, anger in their bellies. Is yours feeling soft? Is yours feeling tense? Don't try to change it, just simply notice it. Next, we're gonna move up to our chest. We're gonna focus on our ribs first. Once again, notice how they're feeling. Do they feel tight there, tense? Do they feel loose and relaxed? Now we're gonna move inward and we're gonna focus on our heart. How is our heart feeling? Can we feel it beating? Is it beating hard, fast, slow? When we think about our heart, we can think about our emotions. Are any emotions coming up for you right now? Take this time to simply notice the feeling without trying to change it, without judgment. Now we're gonna move up to our shoulders, another place where tension is really held. How do your shoulders feel? Do they feel tight? Are they hunched over? I'm sure mine have been most of the day <laughs> working on notes, trying to research things. Take a moment to notice it without judgment. Just get in touch with how you're feeling. We're gonna move down to our arms. Your arms feeling heavy? Do they feel light? Do they feel tingly? Now we're gonna to move to our hands. If your hands are anchored together with your fingertips touching, take a moment and see if you can feel the space in between your hands. 
Is it cold? Is it warm? Can you feel the touch of your fingertips? back up our arms to our neck. How's our neck feeling? Is it tense? Is it relaxed? Now we're going to move up to our face. See how that feels. Finally, we're going to move up to the crown of our head and just notice how it feels if we have a headache, if we have a lot of thoughts floating around in our head. We're just going to simply notice the sensation and let it go. We're going to take this time now to just be with our thoughts, bring up your intention from when we said it before. If you haven't figured it out yet, that's perfectly okay. Now's a good time to just sit with our body, sit with our sensations, notice our thoughts without placing judgment on it and bringing our thoughts back to our breath. I'm going to invite you to focus back on your breath if you've lost yourself in thought. So many times it's so easy to get ourselves distracted and lost in our thoughts. We have so many external distractions going on. I don't know if you can hear, but I have two young kids and They've been talking in the background and even though my husband's home and he's keeping them occupied, you can still kind of hear them. But I know they're safe and so I can take this moment to make that choice for myself. To stay focused and to stay still and to stay present with you all. If you find yourself getting distracted a lot, take a moment and just recognize is this an internal distraction or external? Is it something outside of me? Like two young kids running and playing? Is it something inside of me? Like worried thoughts? And without trying to change anything, just notice it. Become aware of it. And congratulate yourself every time you're able to acknowledge this distraction and bring yourself back to your breath.
take three deep cleansing breaths as we start to come out of this meditation. As you breathe in, picture your intention. Breathe in vitality, new life. And as you breathe out, let go of all those distractions, all those barriers. open if it's comfortable stretching my legs out <laughs> so I just wanted to say thank you and congratulate you on doing another meditation science has proven that whenever you meditate and the more you do it you actually restructure your brain and it becomes stronger and I think it's easy for us to forget that right the brain is what's called plastic meaning it can be changed it's not how it is Meditation has so many benefits, reducing anxiety, increasing your overall happiness. It can release dopamine and serotonin. It can help you sleep better at night, help you be more calm. And a lot of it is because of the brain chemistry and being able to take this moment and just sit there with yourself and reflecting in silence. So thank you all so much for trying this meditation out. If you have any requests, absolutely feel free to shoot us a message and we can customize our meditations to you and what you need. And I would love to hear what your intention is for the week. Like I said, my intention for this week is just going to be action. So I'm going to be, now I can make a plan around it right now. I know my intention. I want it to be more action. Last week was more about resting because we had, my job has spring break, so I was able to kind of relax and recharge. And so this week is my week of action. So I'm going to be able to sit and really plan for my week and wake up earlier and make sure I'm getting my movement in because I need my movement breaks <laughs> and get my meditation in. So our next live that we have is going to be tomorrow at 6 p.m. There is going to be a power yoga flow. I hope you all can make it. If you miss it by any chance, you can always check out our YouTube page. You can go to projectlittlewarriors.com. We also upload the videos there as well. Hope to see you all later and I'll hear from you soon. Have a great day everyone.